Morning, Morning. Dave. Hi, Dave. Well, Dave, I'll just start with this. When it comes to setting the bar, the standard of the, the very next day of the practice, how do you feel with where these guys are at by the finish line here? Yeah, we just we cleared the deck here this this morning, and just went and had a good. We had a good, you know, thirty minute work day, and today was really about you know about our execution. We addressed a couple of you know a couple of uh, a couple of issues that gave us problems last night, but more than anything, just pace and ex execution. Notice that there was no Jaden Schwartz out there, no Brandon Tan. Of uh, any update that you can offer yeah, as far just, as just both maintenance days. Did you learn anything different about the game after rewatching film? I'm assuming you have. And yeah, no, I exactly how you know how it, uh, how it felt after the game. Just you know, um, we you know we didn't we didn't have a ton of energy. You know, the, to start the hockey game, we didn't look like we had a lot of juice and. Um, that carried over into you know into our execution, and when you try to do a little bit, you know a little bit more than you should, you try to you know try to do too much rather than simplify. Um, it uh, usually comes back at you, and that's what happened last night. We were our own worst enemy as that you know as that second period wore on. Um, you know we're, we're one shot away from being back in the hockey game, um, but uh, you know we just we just get putting ourselves in a in a tough spot and eventually that got us. Dave, you mentioned a couple of issues. Do you want to be more specific about what the, what you worked on today? Uh, you know, biggest biggest thing is, you know, from for me our, our transition to our entry to our four checks. We stunk last night. Uh, we didn't have much pace, we didn't have much execution. We know that. I'm not not, you know, talking anything that uh, that we, we all don't know. So those are things that we have to be better in. We were outstanding, uh, you know, in, in uh, for sure for great stretches of both of games one and two uh, in Anaheim and in L.A. in those areas. Those are really important areas for us. So, you know, I, I think um, the realization that, um, you know, we weren't at our best last night, the ability to simplify things, uh, and give ourselves a chance to work back into the hockey game are, are really the things that I take away from from last night and the things that uh, hopefully we can as a group take away um, you know and, uh, and improve when you have a start like that where you guys fall behind early then for the next game do you change anything in terms of preparation no no it's I mean um, we didn't prepare a whole lot differently in game three than we did in games one and two right games one and two we had Good results. So no, this this group knows how to prepare. Um, it didn't go the right way last night. We have to make sure that that doesn't happen again tomorrow night. That's probably the biggest thing, right? You have to, you know, you have a little e extra emphasis, a little added emphasis, and make sure our readiness is there, um, and uh, you know, and make sure the uh, you know those uh, you know the the staple components of our game are there right from the drop of the puck tomorrow. You mentioned struggles in the face-off circles an issue last night. What goes into improvement in that area? Is it just reps in practice, or is there something else to it? No, I mean we have to work. This is a this. It's a challenging league. I mean it. You know, in in the face-off dot. So, um, you know, we got uh, we got a couple. You know, we a couple younger guys that are you know you know that are learning and, uh, and are going to continue to improve, um, and, and are very competitive in the face-off dot. Uh, just collectively as a group, um, you know, we need to do a better job there. It, you know, it always, the focus always, you know, the spotlight is on the centerman. But, you know, in a lot of cases, um, you know, if you're not able to win draws cleanly, it becomes, you know, trying to create 50-50 uh, battles. And that's where, you know, line mates are important. So it's not just all on the centerman. I think that's something we have to be clear. It starts with, with them, for sure, and we have to be better there. Um, and then, you know, everybody around has to help a little bit as well. What's the biggest difference, David, as far as a young player versus a veteran who can handle the face-off circle and has done this for so many years and at, at this league at this level here? Uh, different, different elements. You know, number one, I think you know a lot of the, you know, your, you know, positioning two, three, four seconds before the puck is dropped, uh, often uh, you know is is a pretty good predictor of who's going to win the draw. So there's a process to it, um, and it's you know it's one that. Uh, like I said, we've got uh, smart, competitive guys uh, that are in that spot, and and it's an area that uh, you know I'm really I'm confident we're going to improve in over time. Do you anticipate that we'll see Sprong or Wright tomorrow? Uh, I don't want to get into predicting. You know, we'll we'll just we'll take it uh, like we always do. We'll have a lineup in the morning. Uh, both guys are ready to go, uh, obviously. Um, so we'll uh, you know we'll have our lineup set by tomorrow morning at uh, morning skate. And so many things weren't going quite right last night. Did you see the issues kind of snowball a little bit? Well, you, by snowballing, you know, more so I see it as just, you know, you got guys that care, and so, so you want to do a little bit too much, 
right? You want to try and do too much rather than, you know, going the other way and just simplifying things and, and finding a way to, you know, to work back in. Um, so that's, you know, in, in essence, you know, that's what happened to us during the second period. We're, we're pressing for offense when, you know, in reality, we really didn't need to at that point in time. We're down by two. Um, you know, we just have to find a way to get, get the next one, right, without giving up that third one. Uh, but, uh, you know, like I said, we, we tried to do a little too much in a lot of cases. Um, you know, uh, we were hungry to score, and, you know, that led to, you know, what you saw in terms of some of the defensive breakdowns coming back at us. Thanks, Dave. Thank you very much.